Here is a project RFID based car parking. We have a RFID reader here and we have RFID tags or could be cards. There are two cards were taken. We have a motor which will be operating the boom. We haven't used any motor driver IC but since the motor can be of any higher capacity. So we have used some transistors here in a H bridge configuration being driven from the microcontroller. Then we have an LCD for the details to be understood. Then there are sensing arrangements here where we have a photodiode coupled to a transistor. Here a infrared diode the light on which falls on the photodiode. Similarly here when the light is falling on this this transistor conducts in the process this particular point is low that means goes to ground similarly so and while the car passes the light is interrupted or the infrared light is interrupted and in the process this point changes its state which is fed to the controller here by these points 12 and 13 and in the process action takes place so we'll see how it works now it says rfid based car parking system and uh, supposing the car one in any car tries to enter once the car tries to enter, it says, welcome, swipe the card. It will swipe the card here. Now supposing we have taken two cards. Now supposing he is trying to swipe this particular card, say card 2. It gives an indication that amount is nil. He doesn't have any money in this card. So he is telling to recharge the card. The recharge facilities are available here for 500 rupees and 300 rupees. Now supposing he is recharging here for 500 rupees. It says recharge with 500 rupees. So total 500 rupees. Charge amount is 10 rupees. The balance is 490 rupees and the gate is opening as you can see the motor was operating. And after some time the motor gate closes. So the balance car parking available is for 9 since we have taken 10 as a final parking availability. And when the car leaves from here now supposing the car is leaving from here it goes back to 10 again ready for the next car so he comes to the next car now supposing the same fellow comes the same car number two so he is uh, swiping the car he has got 490 rupees and uh, so 10 rupees gone out of that it's now 480 rupees gate open and it enters now supposing some other person comes and the uh, then the gate is closed and uh, welcome the now the number of car parking available inside is 9 now supposing another person comes with different card so uh, he is trying to enter here once he enters it asking to swipe the card so this person also swipe the card and he also gets an information that his amount is nil. So he supposing goes for a 300 rupees uh, recharge. So the rupees 300 is recharged. His card is recharged with 300 rupees. The total amount is 300 minus 10 rupees. So it will be now 290 rupees and the gate is opening and after some time the gate will close. Motor rotate otherwise and the gate will close and the car passes and goes inside and accordingly the number of parking inside left is 8. Now similarly when the any car goes out from here what do you find the it becomes 9 again because the parking availability inside is 9 and that is how it's an intelligent way it works. We have provided a battery arrangement here but however any supply can be given DC supply for operating it in a continuous basis. We have a buzzer arrangement here and uh, the H-bridge as we had discussed. Thank you.